drifting as J A S M R. Hello, and welcome to Drifty's clinic. Okay, yeah, we are expecting you. Yes, that's right. So you have done allergy testing with my colleague last week. I've checked on your record. That's right. I'm glad to know that everything was okay. So you're ready for the treatment today. Good. Yeah. So for today, we are going to check your face and to see where we need Botox done, and also. We are going to mark your face. I will show you where we will be putting some Botox in. Yeah, yeah. So we will have an assessment first, and I will show you once you agree with everything, then we can have it done today. How is that sound? Good. Oh, I'm glad. Right. Okay. So, well, before we start, I know we have your record here, but I'm just gonna double check some basic details, making sure it is you, and all your details are up to date before we start the treatment. And I would like to take a before shot as well. Yeah. So this is our standard procedure. So we take a photo today, and we take another photo when you come back to us two weeks later. I'll explain the details, but just gonna check your records here. So it's your name, A B C, and E F G. Okay, and your date of birth. Is the third of November, nineteen seventy nine. Okay, and you do not have any allergy. Okay, right. Have you done this before? Correct. Right. Okay. No worries. I will take you through the whole process. Nothing to worry about. Okay, so your contact details. Phone number is zero seven one two three four five six seven eight nine. Okay, so your address is forty five London Street, Newtown. Okay, right. Yes, a full payment would be required today. Right, so everything seems fine. Now we checked everything was correct, and that it is your details. So we're gonna start the treatment. Is that okay? Good. So before we move over to the chair where you can sit down, and I perform the treatment, we will take a before shot. Is that okay? Okay. Won't be a moment. There's the phone. Right. If you just look straight into the camera here. There you go. One, two. And that's it. Right. Okay. That's all done. If you like to just sit on the chair over there and. We'll start some assessment on your face. Yeah, won't be a moment. Okay, so are you sitting nice and comfortably? Good. What I'm going to do is, I'm just gonna touch your face, feel and assess where we need to put the Botox, and I'll mark it. On this sheet of paper, and then we'll mark on your face as well. 
after I show you on the sheet of paper, okay? Yeah, it's a face map, yeah? So I'm just going to put some gloves on now. Yeah, nothing to worry about. We have numbing gel as well. So if you really can't bear the pain, then you can apply some numbing gel. Usually, our clients are fine with it. Mm. So, don't worry. Okay, so I'm going to just to touch your face now. Okay, so let me see here. Just. Okay. Right, so. And if you can do this for me, raise your eyebrows, just so we can see the wrinkles on your forehead. Okay, just stay like that, with your eyebrows raised. Okay. Okay. Right, so I think we will need Right, so about six on your forehead. I'm just going to mark it on this face plan. Okay, so it looks like this. And, and then I will mark on your face accordingly. Spread it out. There you go. So you can see we're going to have six spreading out on your forehead today. And now, if you could frown for me like this. Okay, so if you could stay like that for a minute. Okay, so we will need two, um, one on each side of your brows. So there's the frowning and... Okay, so if you can see, when you frown, we will need one on each side. It's not too bad. So that's why we just have one on each side and I'll explain the whole procedure for you before we start, okay? So that's that. Now let's have a look of your crow feet, okay? So if you smile like this for me, okay? And on this side, mm. there are some wrinkles, which is normal, yeah, don't worry, not too bad, again, so I think what we will do is we will start with three on each side. So we can do top up if this one didn't work quite as expected. So I don't want to put too much because this is your first time. Yeah, so people react differently to Botox. 
so we always start with less dosage and less injections to see how your face is reacting if it's working then we don't need any more top arms mm -hmm. right okay so let me show you here one two three and same to the other side mm -hmm. so that's 14 today yeah 14 injections around your forehead your frown and and your crow feet so yeah that will be plenty for today yeah so you have a look of the face map are you happy with that mm -hmm. so the procedure is i'm going to use a very light alcohol wipe to just clean your face and then I'll be using a marker pen to mark where we're going to put injections of course they'll yeah can be wiped off of course and then we'll start where's the six injections on your forehead then the frowns then three on each side of your eyes is that okay? Yeah, that's how it works. So basically, it's just telling your muscle not to overworking. Yeah, so it doesn't generate more wrinkles. And then today, we're doing these injections. You will see the difference in about two days' time. And as you tested, there was no allergy reactions, so you shouldn't experience any major side effect. There might be some redness around the area. And also, we suggest you not to put any cosmetics and not to do vigorous activities and exercise in the next two hours as well yeah you can have a shower you can wash your face but just not in the first two hours after that you can carry on your life as normal so we are expecting you to come back in two weeks time that's when the Botox is actually working at its best. So what we're going to do is to assess your face and see if any top up is needed. Yeah. How long does it last? Mm. Um, it really depends on each individual and their metabolism. And also, since this is your first time doing it, so it should last three, around three months. Yes. Good. Right, so I'm going to just to wipe your face with this alcohol wipe, right? Just to give it a gentle clean around your forehead so, it's a bit cold okay and then there's your frown okay and on this side I feel crow feet on this side okay great so that's that now I'm going to use a marker pen to mark your head okay so this is a light blue color 
face marking pen and once we've done this all of the Botox injections today I'll use a wipe to clean it off okay so six on your forehead Do this frowning again. So it's round. round this side. Good. And if you smile again, just so I can see here. This syringe we're using is a insulin syringe. I'm going to inject very shallowly into your muscles and to pre prevent your muscle from generating more wrinkles and lines. Yeah, it is sending a signal to your brain. Yeah, so that's how it works. We'll try one first and if you experience um, the pain, if you think the pain is a little bit unbearable, then we can apply this numbing gel. Is that okay? be a little bump after we do these injections. Ready. Okay, so 30 degrees. Ready? Okay. Okay, yeah. So I'm just gonna the next one now. Right, the third one. Okay. And this one. Do you feel? Yeah, it's okay. Do you need numbing gel? No? Good. Yeah, some people say have a chewing gum or something that helps to ease this sharp pain. Yeah, right. So, you feel okay? Then we'll carry on onto the frowns. Yeah? Good. So I'm just gonna pinch this down. 
Good. Yeah. So the reason when I do these frown ones, I need to pinch slightly so it doesn't travel to your eye area. Yeah. So we are going to do the same. That I'm going to pinch your skin. So just making sure that the Botox is not going into your eye. It shouldn't be, because it's very shallow and just to prevent that in case mm -hmm. so we're running out of this, but I think it's enough to do on this side and then we will start a new one, okay? so this is like a fan shape so I'm gonna start on the top, okay? pinch doing really well the curl, that's one done and two and the last one good yeah, so this is gone now I will need to just open another one, won't be a moment, okay? That's all done. See, I told you it isn't that bad. You did really, really well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, small bumps. They will go down in about 15 20 minutes. Right, just gonna discard this. Okay, so we will see. You might need um, later on another day. You could, if you like, to have your eyebrows raised a bit. But I wouldn't suggest any time soon. It's not that bad. Mm -hmm. Right. So what I'm going to do is to use a wipe to wipe off this light blue mark. On your face, yeah, and then we'll have a sit down back to where my desk is just to finish it off, okay? Right, let's get a wipe, a clean wipe, okay? So let me just wipe you. It's all coming up nice and easily. Okay, turn this side. Okay, oh good. 
here. Great. So, how are you feeling? Are you feeling okay? Good. Right, so if you don't mind, just um, sit over there. We're opposite my desk. So I'm just gonna remind you some aftercare details, if that's okay. And then, yeah, it should just take a few minutes. And then you can sit at the reception area. Yeah, and just for about 10-15 minutes, making sure everything is fine, then you can leave. Good. Right. Right, we're all done today. You did really well. I'm impressed. And the bumps don't look that bad now. So may I just remind you not to do any facial, put any makeup or washing your face and doing vigorous activities and exercises in the next two hours. Good. And you have our phone number to you. So if you do experience any um, excessive redness, itchiness, and swell, do contact us. Yeah, so you can come back. If none of this happened, touch wood, hopefully. Um, we are expecting you in two weeks time, where we can assess you and see how the Botox have worked. And yeah, and we can do top up if needed. Yeah, and then as I said earlier, it should last three to four months. Yeah, that's great. Right, so that's it with me today. If you don't mind, can you take a seat outside just by the reception and just stay? 15 minutes yeah making sure everything is fine then feel free to leave yeah my colleague will take care of you yeah she can offer you some water great well nice to see you today and I'll see you in two weeks time take care and bye for now <laughs>